I went into uh, early labor. I went in for a normal checkup the day and my, my doctor said to me, listen, you, you're having contractions, aren't you feeling it, blah de blah de blah And we were preparing for a normal birth and she came early and that was out of the question. And now we needed to go for a cesarean and fine. It's cool, as long as she's a healthy baby, we can deal with that. Uh, unfortunately, I did have preeclampsia, so that's why I went into early labor, so my body wasn't dealing well with what was going on. And my blood pressure just kept on climbing. In theater, my, my body didn't immediately react to the spinal that they, or the epidural that they gave me. And Baba needed to be out quickly. And somewhere during that process of just feeling everything, mentally, physically, I just shut off. And I knew that immediately w that something was wrong when they took my baby out of me because I didn't experience that euphoric feeling and wanting to hold her. There was just a complete numbness about the whole experience. I phoned my gynecologist first and she, she immediately said that I should come in and we spoke about it and the diagnosis was made that I had PND and we had a chat with my doctor and I immediately went on to medication and about three or four weeks after I started using the medication only then did I start feeling that I could cope with things again. And now, three years after Annabelle's birth, I had the privilege of co-producing and writing a concept for a short film that was... It only deals with PND. And it's such a general topic. And it's not only for females out there. It's for the dads as well, because they have their own journey. They have their own story to tell. And I think people can relate to the different characters in the film. And the, the film's called Storm. And it's, it was as part of a, of a project for Silver Scatum Film Festival. There's so many people out there that's still not speaking about postnatal depression. Um, not only because of... There is, there is, I believe there's a stigma around it because you should be feeling euphoric about this. You should be loving this child and what is going on with you. But it's a chemical imbalance. It's a disease. It needs to be treated.